Read more. Let's face it, reading practice test passages may be boring. Some people may be interested in the phases of the moon or the geopolitics of ancient Rome, but most tend to fall asleep after the first paragraph. Staying focused is an enormous part of scoring well on English tests. Even if you can read the words, but you don't know what they mean or how it connects to the rest of the passage, you won't be able to accurately answer the questions. Therefore, you have to increase your focus by getting in the habit of reading more. But you cannot read passages the same way you read a newspaper or novel. Read with certain goals in mind. Read actively. Passive reading is when you read a newspaper, then forget pretty much everything you read besides a vague main idea. You might remember that you read about a war in Syria, but you will not be able to recall important descriptive vocabulary, details in each paragraph, or specific quotes. Active reading will help you remember a lot more of what you read. And this skill is extremely important for all sections of the test. While most exams test your memory, IELTS, TOEFL and TOE tests test your comprehension. They don't want to see if you remember the material, but if you can understand it. Your goal is to understand what you read. How do you do that? Before you start reading a passage, imagine that you are a teacher. You have to explain what you have read to a six year old student. You have to understand the main idea and important vocabulary. Then reword it in a way that a child would understand. Practice doing that, if possible, with a partner. Each of you read a different passage, then explain it in a clear, understandable way. You should also try to remember specific information or quotes from the reading. If you practice the skill, you will massively improve the ability of understanding the material and applying it in English tests. Note taking. Become an expert note taker. Developing note taking skills is essential for solving tests. Here are some tips to improve your note taking. When practicing reading, underline the main ideas and take notes on a piece of paper. Get in the habit of taking notes when listening to English media on YouTube, ebooks, or podcasts or Netflix. Avoid writing full sentences as it takes unnecessary time. Just jot down relevant chunks of the information to get clarity on the main idea. Practice remembering important details as well as writing faster in English. If you get into the habit of taking notes and using those in your answers, it will give you valuable information and structure to work with. This can be used for all sections even before speaking. Make notes to use as a cheat sheet to support your answers.